All right, guys, we are back for another video. First for the channel, not a first for me, but first for the channel. We have Falling in Reverse alone. I know what you all are thinking. Um, I should do Popular Monster or Drugs. Unfortunately, I've already heard those songs. I had a period, you know, late last year where I wasn't posting because of some stuff. Um, but I heard his last five songs. and um, But I haven't heard this song. And I've been really, really impressed by Rodney Radke. Um, I feel like he gets a bit of a bad rap for just being like that guy who's always on the edge. But then I've actually looked into his lyrics, like in um, Losing My Life and Losing My Mind. They seem to have a bit of a duality to them where it's like talking about, he's talking about himself as well as other people. I don't know. So I have the lyric video pulled up for this song. That way we could sort of dive deep and, or semi-deep and have a look and see what he's talking about. Because I feel like he has a massive ego, but he's like self-aware and knows that he does. And he talks about that in his music a little bit. At least that's what I've gotten so far. And this is this is many years before uh, losing my mind. So it may be a bit different, but um, let's check it out. Here we go. I'm excited either way because his music is good. All right, we got this type. Okay. Dang, got some good screams going on. Alright, I like it. Yeah, see, I, I, already it's going in the direction that I I, I felt like it would go in. He's, he's being self-referential and he's going to be like dissing himself and yet putting himself up. You know, it's it's... Yeah, it's cool. Um, yeah, is it wrong that the song's already stuck in my head? I don't know. After all that, this is what fascinates me about Ronnie Radke. After all that, he's saying, like, I spend in 15 minutes what you spend in, like, 15 years. After all of that, all of that, you know, taking it out on everybody who's ever dissed him or said he was nobody or whatever. Now he's flooping back and saying, oh, this is the everything I've known. I had no way of ever knowing if I'll be home. Like, it, it's, I don't. I don't claim to understand everything that he's saying or all the different layers, so please comment down below and let me know what you think is going on here. But it seems to be popping back and forth, and his songs seem to be read in a way that they're saying two things at once. Yeah, it, it seems to be running along the same, the um, the same thing that you know it's um everybody's always attacking him for something. He's pushing the limit all the time, changing up his style or whatever, and yet, yeah. So it's like, it, it, there's so many different layers here because people are coming at him 
without knowing who he really is. So he's firing back, but then he's also like saying in this course, I don't ever want to be alone. So it's like, yeah, I've done all this, but I'm still empty in a way. At least that's what I'm getting from it so far. There's like many, many hidden layers. It's one of the reasons why I like playing that. Yeah. Stuck in my head, by the way. Quick, right before the, uh, right before this this bridge goes off, um, let me know in the comment section if my audio is okay. I just want to make sure I'm, I'm, I'm doing it right and I'm providing quality for you guys. So, let me know if I need to adjust my voice in any way. Fly like a jet, switching my lanes like I'm racing a bet. I'm on that next girl of sex, no doubt I'm on top of the world. Break your neck. Oh, damn. So break your motherfucking neck. Sorry for pausing it in the middle of the chorus, but whatever. Um, yeah, I just the thought just occurred to me. I feel like this is like the beginning of the style that we all know and love now, like with popular monster and drugs. I feel like this was like when he. You could tell that, I, in my opinion, drugs and popular monster are better. They're, they're infinitely better at what this song is trying to be. So I feel like this is him first getting into that genre and exploring that area. And then he's just gotten better over time. It's a good song. I'm not saying bad song. It's stuck in my head. But I still think drugs and popular monster are better. And so he's gotten into this new formula. And he's just perfected it over the years. And yeah. It's a pretty good formula. <laughs> Dang. Yeah, that's that's odd <laughs> in a sense i feel like it's odd that he would automatically like just date the song um i don't know if that was like a thing to do back then it was like maybe 2013 was like a big year or whatever what was i like 15 or something 16 i don't, I don't remember <laughs> um but yeah yeah, I don't, I don't, I think I've already said all I want to say. It's a good song. I think it's like the beginning of the new, of the formula that he's found success with now. Um, and he's just perfected it over and over again. He's gotten a lot better. Um, interesting duality. Um, you know, he's talking about all, how all the people are coming at him. Then in the verse, of course, he's talking about how he doesn't feel like he wants to be alone. So it's interesting. He have all that success and yet he's alone in a sense. So, um, yeah, it just makes me think a little bit you know it's like you have all the success and money but if you don't have someone to to be with or if you're alone then what's the point right so that's kind of what i get from this song in a sense so yeah with all that being said um yeah it's awesome introducing following and refers to the channel um i enjoy uh roddy Radke stuff and, and yes falling in reverse is basically ronnie radke with other guys <laughs> and um yeah it's yeah it's, it's great having it here and um if you like this kind of music like and subscribe for more 
more videos like that. And uh, yeah, I've wasted enough of your time. See you later.